thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Wind just the carry us the way we know. Kai, yes, the wind is bad. Very bad. Let me show. Let me show you guys my view. My view. See her. See her. See her. The wind view of the lights. You know, that's the how the wind is massively blowing. It's crazy. It snowed a couple of days ago. And but snow has cleared, sir. That's it's just very windy. That's just it. Yeah, it's about like minus 22 degrees outside. You guys, anytime I'm doing my skincare, I start sweating inside because of the heater. So, what I do is I go outside, collect fresh air, cold breeze, and then I go back inside. So, let's go back inside because I'm not sweating anymore. Ooh, okay. <sighs> hey, guys what's up welcome to a brand new day in this beautiful city that we are living in right now i'm bimi bad Moss, in case you're new to my channel and my family and i just relocated and i don't know what else to say anyways today is moving day well part one of moving day so since we arrived in this city um in this country of canada in this city for the last couple of weeks i think we've been here for about three weeks now yeah they're about we've been staying at this airbnb this gorgeous beautiful airbnb you guys we've been staying here and i did a quick tour when we came in so you guys kind of saw it it's just a one bedroom that has two beds really nice um but then we had to look for our own apartment and honestly i was even considering sending a message to to the owner of this airbnb that can we rent it out can we rent this place out um as our apartment because it's just so gorgeous it's just it just has like it has everything is furnished the only downside to it is that the public transportation the bus the transit bus does not get here so coming in and out of this place we always have to use a taxi because we are not yet driving in this city so yeah it's been kind of challenging especially like going to pick up um tisha from daycare or taking her to daycare there are about three different taxi systems they don't have uber here there's no uber here we have something called u ride and we have something called kamikabs so the u ride they're like uber even kamikabs they have an app so we order it through the app right but then the u ride will not carry tisha unless there's a car seat and it's not all of them that have car seats some of them have car seats some don't so yeah we order you rise and they get you and they say oh we don't have car seat and that's the end so we always have to order the other one the kami cabs and those ones take longer to get here and they're more slightly more expensive than the other you ride so we've been taking taxis in and out of this city um of this place um because once we get into town you know we can take the bus and everything that's fine but this place it's a new residential area um so you have to drive here so that was the only thing that stopped me <laughs> from sending a message to the owner of the airbnb to say please 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 can we stay at your area like can we rent it out and we'll just discuss price and everything but finally oh, you guys we got our own apartment and i'm just thankful to god because i don't know 
um i thought it was going to take longer for us to get a place i don't know why i thought that but god god has been faithful um we got a place we we signed the lease we got the keys yesterday and we are moving in today but we're not staying there today we're still coming back to this airbnb tonight to sleep one more night we're here for we're here for another three days we still have like three more days to be here but we just decided to move out earlier and then um tisha has gone to daycare her dad took her to daycare this morning so the perfect time to move because i cannot be moving while that girl is around so we already packed our things most of our things we only left like things that we would need tonight and tomorrow so we've packed every other thing we're going to the house now um we also ordered beds because obviously we need beds because that place is does not have anything <laughs> um so and um i'm sure you guys have already seen i would have done a empty house tour so i'm sure you guys are, would have already seen what it looks like i have to go to school i have to go to class by 2 30 um so yeah and then thankfully the apartment that we got the bus stops like the bus going and coming stops right in front of that apartment and the bus is free for me because i'm a student all i need to do is just use my id card and then the bus is also free for tisha because she's a she's under the age of 13 i think yeah so our transportation will be free back and forth thankful for that um but yeah so we need to go now get all our things in there I can go we can come back well i have to go to school my husband will go to school with me to go to school with me and we'll just chill till around time that is my class time and then he will go pick tisha up when he's ready because tisha gets to be a daycare till five but sometimes we just pick her up early like 2 30 3 4 depending Asia. um mm -hmm. and then when he picks her up they'll come back here together she'll eat they watch tv enjoy themselves till i get done from class around like 5 30 and then i would also come home with a taxi but from tomorrow so we'll sleep here tomorrow um i still have laundry i want to do one more load of laundry one more free laundry in this place before we move um so i'll do laundry tomorrow morning once we take the shade to school that takes us to school tomorrow morning we'll do laundry um and then we'll clean this airbnb because I'm not about to allow somebody to tell me that something happened somewhere and they want to charge me extra money for something. So tomorrow is like cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. And we'll just pack like the things that we use today and tomorrow. And we will just, I don't have classes tomorrow, which is perfect. So we'll just take the cap to our apartment, start setting up things. And then go pick, take the bus to go pick Tisha from school and go home. And tomorrow our lives like officially, officially start at in this in this country the reason why i say officially starts in this country is because we live in this airbnb so or we've been living in this airbnb so it gives it a it doesn't still make it reality because you know you're in airbnb there's table there's chair there's tv there's everything provided for you all we just have to do was just buy our groceries and stuff but now we're going to a place where it does not have anything not even ports no pan no nothing so we're pretty much just going to be starting our lives officially here um but i'm very grateful to god honestly um am i scared hell yeah hell yeah very scared um but i also have it at the back of my mind that it's god that brought us here and he's been showing himself in so many ways so really nothing to be scared about anyways don't let me talk too much let me just get dressed let me finish getting dressed i'll show you our back boxes i have to pack my shoes though so these are my shoes three shoes are here my shoes my boots um two years boots too are here two shoes are still here i don't know why it's still here but I've packed me and Tisha's the rest of our shoes here. So these are our boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six. We already got a blender because we had to um, blend pepper and our mix too and stuff. So that has uh, that bag has a lot of our toiletries. That bag has actually even budget. But I'm just using it to carry the last set of things before I retire that bag. This bag has a lot of our food um, products, not the ones in the fridge, just the ones that don't need to be in the fridge. So we're carrying it now. Already cleared out most of the trash. The fridge will carry the things that we need tomorrow. So we still have our water, we have juice for Tisha. The rest of our juice box, I've packed it. Um, I know she will want to drink orange um, tangerine tonight, so I left that there. Um, those tomatoes and stuff will carry tomorrow, Sha. Um, eggs, we'll probably eat them tonight and finish it um even here like some of these things we would get them out bread would 
carry it tomorrow, Sha. There's still leftover water. I need to use these onions to cook. This is a four and chicken that I made. Really yum. Uh, we've cleared this place. This ziplock is ours. I need this um tin tomato. I want to make pasta tonight for us to eat. So that's the pasta there, and that's the Alfredo sauce I'll be using. I left our um spices i'll carry them tomorrow our oil sets are almost finished so that will be disposed um cups from the airbnb uh all these plates is from airbnb oh, nothing is our own <laughs> uh coffee tea is airbnb property coffee maker everything um yeah in the living room nothing is ours oh tisha's legos yeah we need to carry tisha's legos yep i think that's the only thing we need to carry from there um okay so these two boxes are staying that's to his box that's my box for like the clothes i want to do laundry for so i'll put everybody's boxes in the right place um in the bathroom it's just our toiletries for tomorrow that is left over here um so the room this is the clothes that i need to launder so this is the clothes i need to wash my clothes tisha's clothes toys clothes Tisha's small box to accommodate her clothes. Her gloves are in there because I think she might need it and leave in conditioner for tomorrow morning. Um, we've packed out every other thing. So I need to also do laundry on these bed sheets and towels. Um, the Airbnb person said go need that we should just pack them somewhere, but I just I don't know, I just feel like so I'll just wash the bed sheets tomorrow. Once we wake up tomorrow, I'll take them into the laundry room and do all of that. Um, yeah, that's it. Like we've packed everything so yeah that's pretty much it and i really hope to leave this airbnb in a great way like sparkling clean that the owner will be like wow i really really like these people and give us good recommendations or good stars is it stars yeah and we'll also be able to you know give him good stars because his apartment was very helpful to us only downside is location that's just it but yeah anyways let me finish getting ready and call a cab so we can get to step in Bye guys, see you later. Yeah. <laughs> We're moving to. It's not gonna last too long, but it's gonna be pretty miserable. It's kind of weird how it changed overnight. It was yeah. <laughs> one minute everything was great, the next minute. the lights in this place yeah. so i like the lights like the camera lights in here <laughs> hey guys what's up we moved though we finally moved and yeah we've packed our things a year we still have one more night in the airbnb like i said so yeah um we were thinking of getting like one of the cab companies i talked about we we're going to get like a big van um to like move our stuff not big like like a like a six seater like a sienna type of thing um and we were booking and booking and nobody was coming so we're just like okay let's book the other cab company even though they have smaller cars that's what we thought that let's book that one and we'll book two so my husband will book one i'll book one then we'll carry maybe three three bags mothers are booked though only for a a ford you know like a pickup truck <laughs> Like a pickup truck to be the one to pick up our order as i saw it i was like is this not this is a ford like this is a pickup truck and we were just amazed and when we were coming in the car i was telling my husband that you see we see god's hands in the littlest things like 
yes you know we're, in fact there's so many things i'm asking god for right now and you know it's like oh god what is god doing but you see little 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 things like just saved us stress of ordering two cabs and paying two times the money i mean it's just god god has just been good and as we were here the bed people came exactly at one o'clock on the dot they called me that they were outside um that they have brought the bed and it's right there let me show you guys so yeah that's the chaise bed right there yep and then this is Tisha's room, <laughs> you guys. We'll very soon we'll be getting a bed frame, but at least we can sleep for now. I, I brought um what do you call it? Um bed sheets. I brought bed sheets from Nigeria, so we thank God for that. And she has blankets too. Then even for us, our bed is here. So you should bring put the bed down now. Let's see how it fits in the room. Our mattress is here also. Is that the right side? Okay. Hey, whoa. Oh, there she. Is that where you want it to be? Okay. It makes sense if it's there, Abby. Yeah. Even that Tisha's one, wouldn't it make sense to be there? Okay, no, it makes sense. I want make sense to be there. Yeah, so those are our boxes. That brown box that you guys can see there, it was where we went to order our mattress. The guy was telling us that there's a stain on the mattress. You don't see the stain? I never ever see this thing. Oh, that's this. <laughs> oh no, I shall do. Anyway, so he said there was a stain on the mattress, so and then he said that he would give us um free comforter, free blanket. Joshua, did she blanket? He got one cotton one. So give us free blanket though, and I'm just like God, thank you, Sha. <laughs> I love the light that comes in from this room. Yeah, this is very nice. Eh, just because of stain. This is the stain. This is the stain that made this thing self they come out now. This is the stain that shall them give us this thing. I do well alone. All right, so oh so yeah, I'm about to head to into town, into campus. Um wow, it's already 1.30. I have a class by 2 30 so i'm heading there now toy is also going with me so he can chill and then pick tisha from school and then they will head back to the airbnb and i will meet them there after and we'll eat dinner and do our last night in the airbnb by tomorrow night we will be sleeping in this place we still need to get a few things um go to the store maybe today or tomorrow morning get a few things and then come and start our lives officially here okay so that's it from me for now. I'm going to see you guys. <laughs>
melting. Officially moved in today. Just going to start um putting all the things where they are supposed to be. We just packed it the way it was in the Airbnb, so it's just to put things the way they are supposed to be. We we're supposed to go out later today, later sha to get some things for the house and um i need to go to the bank we have quite a number of things to do today Sha. anyways well we cleaned out the airbnb we washed all the sheets all the towels cleaned the bathroom mopped the floors swept laid the beds emptied out the the, the fridge the drawers yeah and we left we said arrivederci <laughs> to the airbnb and now we are finally at our place I just turned on the ether, but it's taking it's taking a hot minute for the ether to. So, okay, it's working now, but maybe I should let me increase it a little, a little, and then space would heat up, shall? Yeah. 